All right, uh, good morning, everyone. Last update, I've uh, been pretty busy the last couple of days. I'm going to take a nice long break, um, possibly 10 to uh, uh, 10 days to two weeks, um, uh, give myself an, a long break from uh, YouTube and uh, making videos, etc. I've got a lot going on, and uh, I just need a, I need a little break. But before I left, I wanted to I wanted to take SSC Spotlight Basketball and do a full treatment. So now there is a second document called Spotlight Basketball. Um, and let's take a look at it. So what I've done is I've actually put basketball time team creation, updated team creation here. The spotlight basketball uh, that Dominic uh, worked on is too damn good to just be an add-on. So I decided to just make spotlight basketball time. Um, and so uh, there's some updated rules for the basketball game, uh, which is uh, using basketball time, big country basketball time, so now you create teams. Now players will have a, a, a numerical digit, and they'll also have their offense, defense grades. So if you roll a zero player, uh, he's an FF, offense F, defense F, right? If you roll up a four, he's a one plus player. He's a C, offense, C, defense. Once you get all your six players made, uh, your sixth man is considered your bench ent entirely but I generally name them after the top sixth man. So once you get them rolled up, you tally them and you just follow the formulas for how you add up the points. Go back up here and look at the team total. So for this team is nine. So their value is nine and they are a B offense and they have one, two, three uh, plus signs. They are a three C defense. So now I actually have every player rated in value. We know a plus signal signals they're a defensive player. Uh, are lean toward being a good defensive player. And we now have their individual uh, grades for the spotlight version of the game, right? I did not put in the normal matchup and normal scoring portion of this. Uh, this is meant to be the spotlight game. So I'm not actually putting in the default matchup charts, etc. You're going to have to use this. So this is the full, I would call this the advanced basketball time. It's just too good. With my, with my original Big Country Basketball uh, team creation modified to really uh, uh, enha enhance Dominic's uh, possession-based basketball spotlight system, so good. Uh, I've also reordered the rules, so now you can read straight through how you play the game, what runs are, then how to do your dominance, your tables, how to, how to play the game, basically. Then the single chart is all you need for the whole game, plus your teams. Uh, and that's described. I've already gone over this in the other video. Nothing's changed here. What has changed is I've added individual values so you can have individual matchups. Uh, there's the game. And then, of course, I still have the um, uh, standard um, play just using team grades. And that's what these are right here, team grades, BC. So if you don't want to slow down and do Victor AG versus Simon Wells, matchup, you can use the uh, team grades, right? So there's two ways to play this using individual matchups or team grades, but either way you can score what the point guard scoring is anyway. All right, so that hasn't changed here. And then I went ahead and put in the 1990 to 91 Chicago Bulls rated in the game, and I put in my Philadelphia 76ers from 90-91. Uh, you can see how well they rate out. The Bulls rate out a 12 with five pluses. They're an AA team. Um, and the 76ers rate out a nine and a half with three pluses. They're a BC team. Uh, Barkley is a stud. He's a two plus highest. He can get outside of not being MVP. Uh, Jordan, the only guys in the leagues that should get a three is the, is the league MVP or or a series MVP, right? So if a, if a player had a league MVP or a series MVP, I would make them a three for their team. So Jordan is the lone three here. Uh, Barkley's a two plus, so he's a, a good scorer and a solid defender. Hawkins is a two; he can score, but not uh, a great defense. Anyway, you can see how they work out here, and you can see the tally for the Bear, uh, the Bulls being a dominant team. Twelve, there are twelve points and five pluses, makes them an AA grade. Uh, and again, you can use the AA grade for this chart here, right here, for every 
the possession or you can have you can look it up and if it says Jordan's facing up Charles Barkley and this is interesting you've got uh, Jordan's a shooting guard so he'll be he'll be matching up Hawkins and you got Barkley and Pippen in a great matchup so when you get those small forward matchups you know it's uh, banging is at elbows will be uh, Barkley you know and potentially Scotty Pippen shooting guard you're going to be looking at from the wing um, you know uh, either driving to the bucket down the baseline or dropping a three uh, would be uh, Michael Jordan or Hershey Hawkins right and Barkley uh, uh, you know if, if the shooting guard is on the small forward you know that that's Michael Jordan um, uh, driving down the baseline for a dunk and he'd be facing up a uh, Barkley trying to stop that dunk so you can really start to visualize the players so this is up it is I will put a link directly to this you can go grab it so this it doesn't replace the the other documents an add-on and then I thought you know this deserves just to be a straight up full game and so I went in and made sure I uh, 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 made rules to accommodate for making pro teams and playing uh, matchups, individual matchups. All right, everybody out there, have a great couple of weeks. Again, I will not be back for at least two weeks. Everybody have a wonderful two weeks. Good day.